Hello and welcome, Cancer. I am Pisces Intuition here with your weekly reading. All right, so Cancer, keep in mind this is a general reading, so not everything will resonate with your situation, and that's okay. Just take what does and leave the rest behind. Also, I encourage you to check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign, just because it can give a little more clarity into your situation. All right, so the first card out, we do have Temperance. Okay, so Cancer, I feel like you are recently are starting to um, go towards finding some kind of balance. Um, this could be possibly entering a new relationship. Let's see, what else is going on here for Cancer? Okay. All right, one more, please. Okay. All right. Okay, so Cancer, I am getting, again, there's um, the Six of Cups, Five of Swords, Temperance, the Eight of Pentacles, and then the Ace of Swords. Um, again, I do feel like you are going to something new. Um, again, finding some kind of balance, possibly healing. Um, I do feel like, though, there is something still kind of not necessarily preventing you or preventing this movement forward, but it is still kind of like affecting it um, with this Five of Swords because I keep getting like something's kind of in the way or I keep getting like there's still some kind of arguments or um, something that because it's almost like there's two different sides is what I keep getting or something. It's like, one, you're trying to just heal and move forward, but there's still something going on that's really not letting you completely do that. Um, with the Six of Cups, there could be children involved for some of you. Um, for others, I'm just getting like you're going towards a soulmate connection, but there's, you know, again, some kind of struggle here, some kind of obstacle still kind of in the way. But I do feel like you are not shying from it. I feel like you are really putting in the work, putting in the focus, you know, trying to figure some things out. Um, you know, this could be you, this could be your person. But I do feel like you're getting clarity or you're going to be getting some clarity soon. I keep getting um, communication or answers, you know, again, you know, those things that provide clarity. I do feel like that's what you're going towards and it's going to be coming in pretty soon. Um, a new opportunity, possibly one that really kind of relieves this, whatever this is that's getting in the way. All right, so now Cancer, let's clarify as we do from left to right, starting with that Six of Cups. Okay. Okay, all right. So we have that Five of Swords coming out again. Um, we also have the Hierophant and we also have Justice. So I kind of feel like somebody's possibly been humbled by a situation, um, possibly the loss of a relationship, could be even a marriage. Um, hmm. See, I still feel, feel like somebody's trying to figure some things out. This could be figuring out, you know, again, healing or still learning some lessons. Um, I keep getting something about reading the fine print. <clears throat> especially if you are going through um, like a divorce or some kind of like court case, um, possibly custody issue. Um, because I do, I am getting like, you know, again, um, children could be involved. So again, just kind of, you know, be cautious um, because it almost feels like somebody's trying to kind of get away with something here, possibly play some mind games um, or use something to their advantage. <clears throat> okay. All right, five of swords, please. Okay. All right, so again, um, there may, may need to be a choice that needs to be made. Somebody could possibly be having like two people fight over them. Um, because then we go back to the lovers where there's a, there's a connection here. Um, possibly, you know, you didn't mean to go towards it. Um, or, you know, the connection just kind of found you, but you know, 
timing, right? <clears throat> um, I do feel, you know, again, there may need to be a choice that needs to be made here. Um, this could be between people. Um, but I kind of keep getting like the time still, like there still needs to be some time or something about timing. Possibly somebody still needs to kind of heal or somebody needs time to make a decision or they're running out of time to make a decision is what I keep getting as well. Um, but I do feel like, you know, for the most part too, a lot of you are going towards like a new connection here. So I feel like there is some struggle about moving on, but I do feel like, again, for the majority of you, you're going towards a new connection. Okay. All right. So clarifying temperance, we have the Knight of Wands. We have the Ten of Pentacles, and then we have the Seven of Cups. Okay, so again, it still feels like somebody's needing to make some decisions here, um, possibly having other options, um, or possibly, I keep getting somebody could possibly be being a little greedy. Um, so maybe, you know, there's not quite an ending to a relationship here. It does feel like, you know, there's, there is something of a loss, but maybe they haven't actually like physically ended it or, you know, like walked away, you know, from the connection. Um, maybe they have emotionally, but not physically, um, you know, it's going to resonate differently, but I do feel like, you know, again, there's some abundance here. I do feel like you are going towards some kind of healing, some kind of new beginning, some kind of, I keep getting like a passion has been reignited here. Okay. So again, I keep getting like you are filling up your cups. Again, something being reignited. Okay, so Eight of Pentacles, please. All right, so we have the Page of Swords, the Seven of Swords, and then Judgment. Okay, so I do feel like, you know, again, somebody is really kind of working and focusing in on having a second chance at love. Um, for those of you who are in like some kind of court, you know, case or something, I do feel like a judgment is being made, you know, um, you're going to be getting an answer. Um, it almost kind of feels like you feel like somebody's getting away with something, but I feel like they don't. I do feel like they get caught. Um, with the Page of Swords, this is also, you know, again, somebody kind of watching somebody. I also keep getting somebody, again, being a little bit immature, possibly using like a child um, to their advantage, like um, like in a custody issue. Let me rephrase that. Um, <laughs> like if you're going through a custody battle or something, it's like, you know, one person, one party is kind of using the child to their advantage to either, you know, possibly get more money or, you know, using the child as some kind of leverage. Um, you know, like, no, you can't leave the state. You don't have my permission, you know, because, um, our child or, you know, that's why you can't move. That's why you can't do this. That's why you can't do that. Or you're never going to see your kid again. You know, something along those lines. Um, I do feel like, you know, cancer, you're, um, for some of you, somebody out there is definitely going through some kind of situation like that. It's kind of being held over their head. Um, so, you know, again, if that's you, um, I do feel like, you know, things are going to be righted. I do feel like the, you know, justice scales are going to be balanced. And I do feel like, again, they kind of get caught, you know, um, really kind of trying to screw you over. Um, for others of you, I am getting, you know, again, a second chance at love. I am getting that. I keep getting something about you could be possibly talking on social media or maybe there's just like um, texting or something like that. I keep getting somebody kind of, I, I can't get away from somebody getting caught. So I don't know if like somebody here is talking to multiple people, has like, you know, um, other options and that's why they're trying to be sneaky with it. But I do feel like, you know, somebody gets caught. All right, going to the Ace of Swords. Okay, so we do have, again, there's that Eight of Pentacles. Um, <clears throat> we also have the Queen of Swords and then the Three of Pentacles. Okay, so as I'm looking at these, this is what really catches my eye. The Three here and then the Three here. So again, I do feel like there's going to be focus. There's going to be putting work in on a collaboration, on a partnership. I feel like something is coming to some kind of closure. Um, again, you know, clarity, getting the answers or getting something that you need that you've been waiting patiently on. 
Um, with the Queen of Swords, you know, again, I'm feeling like some honesty coming in, some communication, but I'm also feeling like, see how her sword is kind of up? I do feel like she is very guarded, but I also feel like she's seeing some kind of change. She, she's seeing some kind of transformation here. Um, and I feel like, you know, again, that's good. I feel like you're going towards some kind of change, some kind of something big happening. I keep getting new opportunity. And, you know, Ace of Swords, that's all about a new opportunity. That's all about a new beginning here. Okay. Um, for those of you, I keep getting that you've been waiting on some communication, and I feel like that's what's going to be coming in as well. So, all right. Let's take some Oracle cards for Cancer. Okay, that is way too many. Um, if I can get them here. Okay, you know what? We're going to go ahead and we're going to take them. <sighs> dark Night of the Soul. So again, somebody could be kind of going through their Dark Night of the Soul or just having a really kind of run of bad luck right now. Um, with Barrier, I do feel like somebody kind of does have a wall up, especially with emotions. And I feel like it partly has to do with, um, you know, again, getting out of a relationship or ending, you know, a relationship here. Um, we also have t divine timing, which again, I did feel like divine timing was very present within the situation. We also have compromise. So I do feel like, you know, again, something's going to be having to come to a compromise. This could be within, like I said, that, um, that legal case, you know, some legal issues. Um, uh, this could be within a partnership as well. Um, because I keep getting like somebody does have other options and they're kind of dating around, but it's like, you know, somebody here is like, okay, I understand that, but you know, now it's time to kind of make a decision. And so it's like, now you're kind of coming to some kind of compromise. Again, I also feel like somebody is waiting on some communication. Um, this could be again about a legal issue, a legal case, um, or again, just waiting on communication from a person. But I do feel like you're going to be getting that clarity. You're going to be getting those answers that you need. Um, fifth dimension. I do feel like, um, you know, your dream state, I feel like you're getting a lot of downloads, um, because then we also have understanding here. Um, so I feel like you're getting some kind of signs again, some kind of downloads. And then for those cancers that are in a separation, I do feel like you're going to be getting a new offer. Um, I'm not really getting reconciliation at all, but I do feel like you're going to be getting a new offer. So if you're one of the cancers out there that is, you know, in a separation, but you're like, I don't have options right now. I'm really not looking. Nobody's coming it forward. Um, they will soon because I do see you having, you know, again, another offer coming through. All right, so Cancer, let's go ahead and let's get a message. What message do you need to know from your person? From a person coming in, from a past person? Okay. This could even be you. Um, I fear the unknown. I love who I am when I'm with you. So again, for that person that's wanting to make a compromise, um, I do feel like, you know, there is someone who they feel that companionship, they feel that partnership. So for those of you who do, do have like, you know, some, um, some options out there, I do feel like one of them, you are really kind of bonding with one of them. You're really vibing with, um, for those of you, like I said, that don't have anybody just yet an offer is going to be coming in that, you know, again, you're really going to vibe with. So, all right, let's get some charms here for cancer. Okay. All right. So cancer, we do have the little heart. So see, again, I feel like where something's ended, there's going to be a new beginning. It's like, you know, something's coming back to life. Um, something's being revived is what I keep getting with a little coin where something's missing. <clears throat> This could be talking about finances, kind of having, you know, a run of bad luck as far as like finances go. Um, so just kind of, you know, watch spending again with this little skull here. I do feel like there's some kind of ending here, but I also feel like where there's an ending, there's also a new beginning. You know, again, something is being possibly revived or just, you know, and it does, when I say revived, it does not have to mean a past person. It just means, you know, um, some, you know, something is bringing some feelings up. Um, I also keep getting that somebody could be in like a healing field. Um, somebody's really into history. I keep getting somebody is actually studying history. Um, we also have the little charm that says weakness is a choice. So I do feel like, you know, again, you're kind of amping yourself up, kind of, you know, getting your talking to yourself like, you know, okay, I can't just give up. Like, you know, I got to keep going. Uh, we also have a guitar. So music could be very important to you. Um, this could be writing music. This could be playing music. 
Um, this could be, you know, being in a band, um, just using, you know, music as like a form of therapy. But I do feel somebody really loves music. With the little leaves, again, I'm seeing some kind of transformation. Um, I see like there's a new beginning here because I do feel like something has ended. And again, I have to say going towards a new beginning. And even though it still feels like pieces are missing, you're still going towards something. Um, I feel like you're going towards peace. With the little paw print, I get somebody who could be a veterinarian. Um, I was getting somebody who's in like a healing type of field. Um, so that could mean, you know, for animals as well. Um, and I also get, you know, possibly just being, you know, an animal lover. Um, with the love here and the little heart, again, I do feel like there's going to be finding some love. Um, again, your heart being, you know, revived. There's like new feelings here for a person. And then with the little flamingo, and you know, again, I feel like you're definitely finding some balance here. Um, you know, you're finding your footing is what I keep getting. So, all right, well, Cancer, that is what I have for you. So thank you so very much for watching. And as always, take care.